The Herod River. The spring of it. The cave here, the sacred cave, with water gushing out, it feeds the Jordan River. This is the combination that invites some temples or invites worshiping of the gods, wherever those gods are. Greek mythology started with those wild gods such as the god of the sea and the god of the wind and the Peter means rock. And on this rock, on this stable rock, I'm going to build my church. You are going to be... So, you know, for Catholics, this is a, a declaration that he was the first pope, but for everyone, this is the declaration that this is the place where uh, Jesus revealed himself or through Peter, he revealed himself to his disciples. And since then, just uh, to complete, uh, from that time on, Jesus began to explain to his disciples that he must go to Jerusalem and suffer many things at the hands of the elders. <laughs> all the way to the northern most part of the country to build the beginning part of the Jordan and a pool before it hits the river to attract the people to go there standing in front of the ancient city walls from the time of the kings although it is uh, you see the the story from Joshua about the sons of Dan that went to the north and the uh, to Leshem, another name of this city lies Leshem Dan, and uh, dwelt therein from Joshua. But this, you <laughs> <laughs> can hear me. Try to get closer and see this model that I'm standing in front of and take a look at it later. <laughs> It says the following day, Jesus, Yeshua, wanted to go to Galilee, and he found Philip and said, follow me. And then, he, then in the next verse he says, now Philip was from Bethsaida, the city of Andrew and Peter. So here is the, we are in the hometown or right around where Peter grew up, Andrew and Philip. They all grew up here. Town of fishermen. At that time, the Sea of Galilee was much closer. It has receded, but it was much closer. This was the town of the fishermen. Um, and so you can imagine there's not to be any regret in the Lord. Because if you have salvation, there's no regret. God redeems it. He says, though your sins are as scarlet, I'll make them as white as snow. Meaning, he even changes the past. How do you change a sin? Makes it so that the, there is, though, a godly sorrow that leads to repentance. And then that's it. Repentance. No regret, but repentance. And that's Peter's life. He kept coming back. I got a river of life flowing out of the sea. Makes the land. I say to walk in the blind to see. Open. Open to the doors as the path is free. I got a river. Oh. I got a river of life flowing out of the sea. Shocked a mile. This a 
He's about to blow it so I'm gonna get it. The Sea of Galilee. The ancient synagogue. Claim that they remind you of the Oh, uh -huh. 